Right, so what's, what have I been doing today? Today, I have, I'm gonna tidy that up a little bit. I have, I've been dealing with this MPH thing, okay? So I've, I've sent a few stickers in the post already. In fact, let's backtrack a little bit. Let's go back to the video that I recently done explaining that I had this idea, uh, it was a brand, it was called MPH. In that video, I explained two things, two free giveaways. One, um, the free giveaway was an MPH sticker, and two was the Calvin's Car Diary mixtape. Now, to receive uh, an MPH sticker, what you had to do was email me your postal address, and I would just simply stick one in the post. Now, before I stuck them stickers in the post, in fact, let's go back to receiving them emails. I come to work the following day, which was a Monday. Obviously, I posted a video on the Sunday. I came to work on the Monday, and the amount of emails that I got from you lot was crazy. I was shocked, genuinely shocked. Like, obviously, I wanted a great response, and I, ex I didn't expect a great response. I have faith in the MPH. I think it's a bloody good brand. I think it's a good idea. Um, I don't know, like I said, I don't know where I'm going with it, but I think it's a lot, something that a lot of us are going to like. We're going to... Get your words out properly, Cal. A lot of us will definitely like. So I came to work the next day and I, I was overwhelmed. The, letter, the emails that I received from you lot were just like brilliant. I've got so many positive emails. People telling me that they love my stuff and love my editing and my music and so on. So what I'd done was I typed up a letter and stuck it in the envelope with the sticker and I, ha I signed every letter and it was just a letter to say thanks to everyone who got involved. <coughs> Excuse me. So, all them letters are here, or a lot of them are here. And they're, oh, I don't want to show you the addresses, that's, that's very confidential. I'll blank that address out. But there's loads here. You can see that there's a lot here and every single one of them people in that pile, they're going to be receiving a sticker in the next couple of days. And by the time this video goes live, you would have already received these stickers, okay? But I was overwhelmed, one, with how many I've got, and two, the um, three things actually. One, with how many I've got, two, with some of the lovely emails I've received from you guys, and three, the area that, the, the country, the, the wide area that watch my videos. So I've got Hampshire, I've got Kings Langley, I've got Mansfield, I've got Belfast, Ontario, in Canada, okay? So we've got a lady called Vivian. Vivian, I hope, I'm, you must be watching this now, I don't know, but Vivian in Canada, I'm not gonna give you, uh, show you here uh, her address, but Vivian, comment below please, just to let me know that um, you watched this video and, and also let me know that you received your sticker. That's also going in the post today. Um, but I've got so many people all over the country and I've got one in Canada. So I'm well happy with that. Um, what I've decided to do is, sorry if I'm banging on a little bit, but this is all important to me. What I've decided to do is hand deliver a few of these envelopes. So you can see all of these have got stamps on them. Um, they are second class, I suppose it kept the cost down. <laughs> um, but I've got a handful of them here. I'll show you that side. And I don't want to show anyone's addresses. Them ones don't have stamps in them. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hand deliver them. There are local people in like Luton and Dunstable. I am gonna hand deliver them. I'm not gonna do it today because it's the end of the day now and it's a Friday afternoon for me. But tomorrow is Saturday and I'm planning to do it tomorrow in my GTR. I'm gonna bring my GTR into work tomorrow, grab these letters and I'm gonna hand deliver some of these letters to you lot, all right? So the people that I'm going out to don't actually know that I'm coming. So that'll be quite interesting. I do hope that they're gonna be in. It'd be a little bit disappointing if they're not in, but I will make an effort to go back if they're not, I suppose. Um, Saturday should be a good day though, because generally most people are at home at the weekend. So that's the plan for today's video. So let's see how it goes. I hope you enjoy it. Like I say, it's a little bit different, but I think it'll be pretty cool. Let's go jump in the GTR and go and meet some of you lot. Okay, so it's now the following day. Uh, I'm sat in a GTR, obviously, and I've got that camera set up so you can see the passenger seat as well. So we could have some passengers in the car today. Um, we'll see how it goes. I don't want to sort of um, 
jinx myself, that might not happen, but uh, that is the plan to hopefully get some of you guys in the passenger seat in my car. Uh, I've got a, more than a handful, I've got a good few envelopes here with no stamps on, I'll cover that address, but they've got no stamps on. These are all the ones that are gonna be hand delivered by me today. Um, as you know, my office is in Dunstable on the High Street. Uh, so what I'm gonna do is I'm not gonna do anything uh, too far afield. I'm not gonna go uh, do any major journeys because if these were all spread across the country, that'd probably take a couple of days to deliver all of them. Uh, I'm gonna focus on the local area, I've got a couple to do in Dunstable and then I'm going over to my hometown of Luton. I'm proud to be from Luton, I love Luton. Uh, I've got a, a good few here going to Luton as well. So I'm, I'm well happy that I've got a load of Luton people supporting what I'm doing. So uh, we're gonna start off with, in fact, let's list off the name of people. We've got Brendan Abbott. Uh, he's gonna be the first one on the list. He's literally up the road from my shop. I know Brendan, uh, but he always tells me he loves my videos and he's just a great guy. I've known him for a little while now. Um, but I'm gonna go see him first. Brendan Abbott, Lewis Thompson, he's also in Dunstable, he's the second one on the list. Aaron Brinkley, he's actually a friend of mine, I'm gonna go see him today as well, and he keeps asking me to go out in my car, hence the wide angle lens to cover the passenger seat. So Aaron, you're watching this now, I'm on my way to go pick you up, mate, to take you out in the GTR. At long last, you keep nagging me for a drive and I'm gonna take you out on it today, all right? Um, Faisal Khan, I've never met Faisal, but, um, He's asked for an MPH sticker, he's got two in here. I'm gonna send that, to hand deliver that today in Luton. Theo Blankley, now this lad, right, This he's such a cool lad. He's gotta be the youngest massive petrol head on, out of everyone that, that in the in the clan, what should we call it, the clan, the, clan, the team MPH. He's the youngest guy of the lot. His mum, uh, Natalie, really pushes him to, to follow the not just me, loads of other YouTubers as well. Uh, he's a proper car mad guy and he's got a cat called Enzo. How cool is that? So I'm gonna go see Theo as well today. He's in Sunderland Park in Luton, which is where I'm from. Uh, Samir Akbar, uh, he's in Luton as well. I'm gonna go see him today. Paul Martin, I'm gonna go see you as well today, Paul. Never met you before, but I'm looking forward to seeing you today. Hopefully you're in. If you're not, um, I'll stick it through your letterbox. Um, Cameron Jeffries, I bear in mind that is a valid point. I haven't told anyone that I'm coming. This is all a surprise. I put a little thing on my Instagram this morning to say that I'm gonna be visiting a few people, but I haven't mentioned to anyone that I'm coming their way. So if any of these aren't in, there's, there's not really much I can do. I have thought about that. I've kind of thought about trying to message everyone and tell them that I'm coming and pre-warn them. I think I'd rather do it by surprise. I'm a bit more, I like doing that sort of stuff, all right? so. Yeah, so Cameron Jeffries, he's the next one. And then Erin uh, Tot, I know Erin from a, a, from a kid. She's grown up to be a proper petrol head. She loves cars, she's well involved with the car scene. So, got a hell of a lot there to do. GTR is now clean. Let's hit the road and start off with delivery number one. It's Brendan Abbott. Brendan Abbott of BA Detailing. So, let's go see Brendan. Oh, it doesn't look like Brendan's in. So, the first one is unfortunately going to be a bit of a failure. I'll park the car up here. Brendan's obviously at work today, so sorry Brendan. You're gonna have to come and see me at work another day, but I'm gonna still hand deliver your, your envelope as I plan to. I'm gonna go run in and do that right now. Let's go. Right, let me get my stuff out of the way. So I, um, sorry, we are recording Brendan. So I thought Brendan was out, but it's actually, um, his car's not here today. Why is your car not here? It's getting repaired. Well, gearbox is knackered here. Is it really? Yeah. So Brendan's got a new, newish course, uh, Astra VXR and got gearbox issues. What is it getting fixed under warranty? Hopefully, yeah. Really? Yeah, it wasn't my fault, so hopefully, yeah. What, man? Service and it come back. Not good. Not good, mate, not good. Did you see it on my Instagram then? Yeah, I saw it, yeah, I was following it this morning. I thought, I don't know if it'll turn up or not. <laughs> yeah, it's very cool. <laughs> Power's cool in general, though, isn't it? Like, even your car, there's all four wheels to spin it. Yeah. You, can't, you just can't do it. As soon as there's, well, you've seen the videos, as soon as there's damp on the road, you literally. No, 
Und dann halt so. Right, so the next one is uh, Lewis Thompson, also in Dunstable. So we'll um, put his address into Google. This does have sat nav, by the way, but your iPhone's just easy, isn't it? Right, hand delivery number two. Go. That's it, right, turn that off, let the engine have a little break. I'll see you in a bit. Oh man, um, Lewis works every other Saturday morning and today is that Saturday morning that he's working. So he is apparently gonna be back this afternoon. I will try and get back and see you later, Lewis, but um, I've got a lot to do today. So if not, there's no doubt we'll catch up at some point. We're in the same town as each other, so I'll definitely see you again at some stage. But you're now, you've now got your massive petrol head stickers, um, so hopefully I'll see a picture of them from you at some stage, all right? Let's go on to the next one. So now we're gonna head over to Luton. I think the next one I wanna do is, um, where is he, where is he? Right at the bottom, Aaron Brinkley. So we're gonna head over to the near Luton Town Centre. We're gonna go see Aaron Brinkley. That's the next one on the list, all right? I'll stop recording and we'll get back on when I'm near Aaron's house, all right? See you in a bit. This should be open, Aaron. No, yeah? Is that filming? Are you filming? You're still filming, yeah? Um, so, Aaron wasn't expecting it at all. So you, I put a thing on Instagram. Have you seen, have you seen Instagram this morning? No, no. I I've gone on my phone. You look like you just woke up. <laughs> no, I've been washing the house. Oh, right. <laughs> Ooh, um, Saturday morning. So you've been wanting to go out in this car for ages, haven't you? A long time, ever <laughs> since you got it. <laughs> Jesus. Track control, I'll put it on because... You have to. Yeah, I have to, yeah. I thought, well, I can, I can switch it off, but it's... Um, See what will happen. It's just look, it, it's like an ice rink. So like now it will wheel spin. Why not? But you see, it's a lot quicker. There's no restriction there, is no, there? Not at all. <laughs> it's funny, isn't it? Oh, it's amazing. <laughs> Absolutely amazing. So much quicker than I thought it would be. I knew they were quick. Obviously, yeah, you know they're quick, but you just don't know what to expect, do you? No, not at all. It fit, yeah, yeah, it's comfortable, isn't it? Normal car, if you want it to be. Yeah, yeah, it is that, definitely. Well, you've got, you can drive it in auto mode. I put it in auto mode down, now, and it is calm as anything in auto mode. It's really chilled. Oh, brilliant. So, what's the average MPH? What's the average MPH? MPH. MPG. MPG, yeah. <laughs> you got MPH with mine? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> MPG is, uh, I don't actually know, but I reckon it's, it's definitely less than 10. Wow. It's terrible on fuel. That is another reason why I don't use it very no. much. But is that because of the way you drive it? That is probably because <laughs> of the way I drive it, yeah. Well, like I said, auto mode, like it's now in third gear, and we're not even doing we're doing about 15 mile an hour. So auto mode puts it up a gear straight away, look, fourth, and before you know it, it'd be straight in sixth. I never wow. drive it in auto mode. No. Never, ever. I always have it in manual mode, because I, want, I like to play with it. Like, oh, like yeah. you said, every time you drive it, you, I want to feel the power, so yeah. I'm just constantly giving it that all the time. Yeah. So yeah, that's why my MPG is really bad. <laughs> <laughs> it's a nightmare, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Right. I'm glad I took you out on it. I'm actually like good to see you in that. Oh mate. And uh, that's I'm made fine. my day. Made my year. <laughs> <laughs> Good man, I'm happy. Absolutely made my year. I'll, awesome. uh, 
Yeah, I'll catch you soon, yeah? Oh, I appreciate good that. Good to see you, man. Brilliant. Thank, thank you, you so cheers. much. I'll take them. And uh, good luck with everything else in yeah, the uh, future. Thank you. Yeah, Sam, thank you, mate. See you later, buddy. Cheers, see ya. Okay, so that was Aaron Brinkley. He's basically a friend of the family, proper, proper nice guy. In fact, Aaron, I need to get a photo of you, actually. Yeah. Is that all right, yeah? Um, one second. Cameron Jeffries, we're gonna go there now, all right? Let's go see Cameron Jeffries. Let's go see if Cameron's in, shall we? I've done this the wrong way. I was, maybe I should have pre-warned everyone that I was coming. Cameron isn't in, but he has now got his envelope with his letter in and his two massive petrol head stickers. Let's go see Paul Martin now, yeah? It's a shame, it's such a shame that I'm sort of, I don't know, have I done it the right way? Is it the wrong way? I kind of like to surprise people. Let's go see um, number four, five, I don't know where we're at now. Paul Martin. Hopefully he's in. Paul. Yeah, it's special delivery. You're in. Everyone's in the road there. Yeah, it's alright. Yeah, of course it is. Yeah, that's what I'm here for. Yeah, we're filming inside, alright? Paul's in, Paul's in. So, um, let's uh, get all this stuff out of the way. We jump in, mate. Good to meet you, man. Yeah. <laughs> we can't get much power down because nah, it's, wet, it's so wet. Like, even on the bed, you can feel the back end just wants to kick, yeah. doesn't it? So it's just got like a variable control with the front and the back? Yeah, yeah. Like well, it's, 50, mainly, 50. It's, it's mainly to the back, yeah. sends power to the back. When the back split, uh, slips, yeah. it sends the power to the front. Very nice. <laughs> oh well, top man, give me yeah, a shout nice when you can't though, I'll come yeah, out and Yeah, Sam, good to meet you. Nice to meet you, man. Take it easy, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah cheers mate, see ya. <laughs> Sam here, Akbar. I'm coming to you now, mate. And you don't even know it, do you? Okay, so we're now at Samir's house. Let's go see if he's in. <laughs> right, Sam is in. He looks like he's just woke up. Um, I think he's a bit tired. A little bit shocked as well. What did you just say? You've been working, Sammy? I've just been doing a little workout. Oh, a workout? Yeah. That's why you look tired. So you ain't yeah. been sleeping, have you? Fair play. On the gym, yeah? Yeah. So let's grab them envelopes. That was Sam here. He's got a 20 valve Audi UR Quattro. I'm a huge fan of them cars. Next up, we've got Faisal Khan. He's not in. <laughs> oh man. Definitely the right house because there's a, a 3 Series there, an E46, proper nice car with Faz on the number plate. So I'm guessing that is his car. So we're going to head over to Sunderland Park now to go and see. Erin and Theo. Erin's not in either. Oh man, that's fine. I will definitely see Erin about at some stage. Uh, her mum was there. Like I said, I know I know the family from from a young age. Just make sure you're definitely filming. I'm talking not talking to nobody. You are recording. Uh, they are one of the kindest families I've ever known. Honestly, they're such a nice family. Erin's sister Faye looked after my boy when he was in hospital, so I've got a lot of love for that family. So I'm a bit gutted uh, 
Erin weren't about, but I saw them, saw their mum, and uh, she was well happy to see me. So I'm now going to go and see Theo. Right, I'll stop recording there, and I'll be back in a bit. Hopefully with Theo. We'll see how it goes. Yeah, see you in a bit. Is your name Enzo? Are you Enzo the cat? Hello. You're not gonna bite me, are you? You must be Enzo, surely. Yeah. Well, Enzo, you're gonna give this to Theo for me. Yeah. He's not in, is he? Okay. Oh man. The last one of the day is Theo. <laughs> And he's also not in, so a little bit gutted. I'm currently filming on my iPhone, by the way, so the camera quality is probably not that great. But um, I will definitely catch up with these people at some stage. Bye, Enzo. Bye. Okay, so we're done. A uh, bit annoying that everyone weren't in. It would have been nice to have met everyone and took everyone out in the car, but it's just one of them things, I suppose. I, I don't regret keeping it a secret. I love a secret, like I said, but it's just a bit of a shame that everyone went in. I will definitely try in my hardest next year to meet as many of you as I possibly can because I know I, I like to meet people. I'm one of them kind of guys. I like to meet new people all the time. So it's good to meet like-minded, massive petrol heads. So um, I've had a brilliant day today and I think what I, did, I was driving down the road earlier, I had a little thought and I was thinking, it's really odd that YouTube is just basically a website. It's just, it's I suppose it's just a server somewhere in the world and we all save videos to this server and then we all access that server and watch them videos and whoever set up YouTube, I don't know loads about it, but they're a clever person, they ain't got a clue how good they made my day today. I've had a bloody brilliant day, it's so cool that so many of you lot have sent me these emails and asked for these stickers, you're on board with this MPH thing and I've been running around in my GTR which I know a lot of you lot love delivering these envelopes, writing out letters, it's just wicked. So I've had a brilliant day and it was nice to meet a, a few of you today and um, I'm grateful. Bottom line is I'm just bloody grateful, I'm, I'm loving it, all right? So thanks for watching, I know it's a little bit of a different video but it's all channel related so I'm trying to keep to that, that, that theme as such. So hope you enjoyed it, I definitely enjoyed it. I got to drive my GTR today as well, which I haven't done for a long time. Uh, if you did enjoy the video, Give it a thumbs up, and I am sorry that I couldn't do this for everyone. Obviously, that would be impossible. Um, I am currently out of stock of MPH stickers, but by the time this video goes live, I'm sure I'll have more anyway. Uh, but for now, thank you very much. I do hope you enjoyed it. Like I said, if you did, hit the thumbs up button. If you're new to my channel, which some of you probably are, hit the subscribe button, and I'll see you very soon, all right? See you later.